hello guys and welcome back my name is wills and uh, on my channel i share with you business ideas after doing my research and this is my report uh, on how to make 1000 every day with a pool table business so if you find i hope this video will be useful to you and if, if if that is the case you can give me the likes you can share you can also subscribe to my channel so that you continue getting more notifications on business ideas so a pool table pool table uh, is a business name observe and i've done some research and uh, i'm now going to show you why do we why why should you choose a pool table now there is growing interest uh, among young people mavijana wanapenda sana mambo ya pool and it's gaining a lot of popularity within urban areas for example karibu na universities colleges and uh, masoko and so on so the rising population of young people is also another thing that would make uh, a pool table viable then it's also affordable to most uh, young people a pool table or game costs around 20 shillings so those are some of the reasons that would make this business attractive so if you are able to make 1000 per day on the pool business every month you can be drawing around 30000 then per year you'll be making around 360000 per year so this is a very profitable business that you can consider on your list of businesses so SWOT analysis now for any business doing a SWOT analysis is very important because it helps you to identify uh, the risks involved in doing that business so apart from the risks you have strengths strengths in zile vitu zinafanya biashara inakuwa strong in terms of uh, choice so you don't need to be there one of the strengths of a pool table kwamba you don't have to be there to to manage the business once you bought the necessary materials and resources unaachia mtu mwenye amekuwa trained and then uh, he does the collection of the money so we also have uh, another strength in terms of customer loyalty what wakisha penda your pool area they will always be coming back because they it's near to them or they find it convenient then uh, in terms of opportunities you can expand the business if you start uh, one pool table you can expand it to two or three and so on and this will increase your revenue you can also do partnerships for example with clubs and uh, restaurants and so on so that's uh, in terms of opportunities then weaknesses you can uh, uh, view in terms of uh, competition competition is uh, a weakness it is easy to start which means that uh, competitors are easy new entrants what when you want to dani then slow growth for it to pick you need to be patient so that people can start uh, knowing that uh, you are your small room or whatever has a, a pool table we also depend on referrals what one ambiana kutaka pool table enda kwa flani ama enda joint flani then in terms of threats negative behavior can be a threat to this business 
I will explain. You have no control of whoever is coming to play your pool table. So you'll find that your area will start attracting people of all manner of behavior, including criminals, including people who are doing drugs and substance abuse. Okay? So you may find that these negative behaviors are likely to impact negatively on your business. Then you also have extortion, extortion from uh, uh, rogue police officers. They may harass your business and harass your attendant. So if he gives into the harassment, they will, they will start extorting money, just like in the wines and spirits. So let's go to the startup breakdown. I will need a, a rent and deposit. If you are doing a, a you, you may need a shed eh, for the players to be resting there. At waki chesa pool wanga wanataka maali kuko cool. So this may cost you 20,000. You may need licenses. You may need the ordinary single business permit plus another license for betting and uh, licensing board. Then uh, we also need furniture, benches and chairs for for those who are playing the pool table. We also need a television and music. So this may cost you 50,000. You may need the you will you will uh, you will need the pool table, which is the key. Uh, how do you call it? Equipment. Build a pool table anywhere you will not be able to do the business. So this may cost you anything from ninety thousand. Then miscellaneous will be around fifteen thousand. So in total, if you have roughly two hundred thousand you'll be able to start your pool business so what are the key success factors one of the key success fa factors in location you have to locate your pool table where we have uh, young people so the suitable locations is mostly near clubs near universities and uh, any other urban area where young people are likely to be found. You will also need a good manager, somebody who is honest, and somebody who will be able to manage the, the premises properly. Then be patient. Once you've started your pool business, you need to give it two or three months. What was Kianza Kuwa Ambiana? Pale Kuna Pool, Pale Kuna Pool. You will start seeing. Uh, good results so thank you for watching if you have any questions you can uh, give me comments uh, you can also find me on my twitter profile you also find me on my fe facebook page you can also send me an email if you have any issue about uh, writing business plans TVs and so on. So thank you for watching and see you in the next video.